Hey guys, this is Matt from Mice Chat. Today is Tuesday, October 25th, 2011. And since it's Tuesday, it's new release day, and the first new release is an animated Winnie the Pooh. Also out on Blu-ray is Marvel Studios' Captain America. Speaking of the first Avenger, did you see the Avengers trailer last week? Came out and got over 10 million hits in the first 24 hours. Like everybody else in this is cool, but Robert Downey Jr. is the Iron Man. Lastly, we finally got a street day for The Rocketeer. It's coming out on Blu-ray and Disney DVD on December 13th. In the Starcade, Disney Universe dropped today in all the major systems. It looks like it's going to play like the Lego games with a little Mario Party mixed in. There's like 40 costumes that you can change into and they each have unique weapons. At Disney's Animal Kingdom, James Cameron was spotted touring potential sites for his Pandora Land. And beginning this week, Disney Dining is actually going to start charging guests $10 per person if you make a reservation and then don't show up. Coming up next is DCA's Tower of Terror. Even though California Adventure opened in 2001, the Tower of Terror didn't come along until May of 2004. Throughout the lobby are a bunch of individual items that are from different Twilight Zone episodes. So there's actually a ton of trivia hidden just in the lobby. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and list the Twilight Zone references in the description area. At a whopping $1,000 per costume, the Bellhop costumes are the most expensive in the park. Uh, the ride system is totally different too. In Florida, you have the fifth dimension scene where the car goes down the hallway. And in California, we don't have that. Welcome everyone to the Hollywood Tower Hotel. Your rooms are not quite ready yet, but please feel free to browse around the library while we finish getting your rooms ready for you. You unlock this door with the key of imagination. Beyond it is another dimension. A dimension of sound. A dimension of sight. A dimension of mind. You're moving into a land of both shadow and substance, of things and ideas. You've just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. Hollywood, 1939. Amid the glitz and the glitter of a bustling young movie town at the height of its golden age, the Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star in its own right, a beacon for the show business elite. Now, Something is about to happen that will change all that. The time is now on an evening very much like the one we have just witnessed. Tonight's story in the Twilight Zone is somewhat unique and calls for a different kind of introduction. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard, because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And this elevator travels directly to the Twilight Zone. Ladies and gentlemen, your rooms are now ready. Wave goodbye to the real world. You have just entered the Twilight Zone. What happened here to dim the lights of Hollywood's brightest showplace is about to move forward once again. Step through the door of an elevator and into a nightmare. That door is opening once again. But this time, it's opening for you.
you know just what kind of vacancy you're filling, will you find yourself a permanent resident? Oh, do I like that one?